President Trump has declared the opioid crisis a national health emergency. He says he wants to teach kids about the dangers of the painkillers. Today we are learning about Colorado's plans for this program. Our Tori Mason is live at North High School. Tori, walk us through this. How did the program work? Well, Britt, the face of prescription drug abuse in high school isn't always the failing kid who never shows up to class. Sometimes it's the overachieving student who takes their friends Adderall so they can stay up later to study. Now, many think that it's safe because a doctor prescribed it and nothing's going to happen. But in reality, when you misuse prescription drugs, they can be just as dangerous, if not more, than the drugs that are made illegally. After marijuana, prescription and over-the-counter medications are the most commonly abused drugs among high school seniors. To help Colorado students say no, Walmart is sponsoring a new program that's being rolled out in high schools across the state. The online course teaches students about the dangers of prescription drugs and what can happen if they fall into the wrong hands. Attorney General Cynthia Kaufman says it's important schools encourage students to make smart, informed decisions, but a lot of that education should begin at home. It's not cliche to say kids are seeing things at a younger age than we did um, as adults growing up and they need to learn earlier than we think about the risks so that they can make good decisions. I think the program is really informative. It really tells you like every side effect and like how it can affect you, what it does to your body and it'll definitely help kids make the right decision. Now, Walmart expressed their support for President Trump's declaration on a public health emergency on opioids last week. They've since committed to bringing this curriculum to schools in Arkansas, Colorado, Illinois, and Indiana, all at no cost to the schools. Reporting live in Denver, Tori Mason covering Colorado First. Tori, thank you very much for that.